Panimation here and today I'll be showing you guys how to use uh, chopsticks uh, before we start actually this is a doll and I heard from other youtubers that apparently if you have some kind of doll uh, in the background then you should be getting views so please give me them views actually what most youtubers have they're quite fluffy and cute this might actually scare away viewers uh... Anyway, so chopsticks, you may have seen them mostly in Japanese or Chinese restaurants and in Japanese ones, uh, they should be in something like this, so they've got a paper uh, like cover around the actual chopstick itself. The chopsticks, uh, they normally come glued here, so you just have to snap it like that. The way you hold chopsticks, uh, the first, just take one first and hold it between these two fingers, like so. Put it in between this part, so like that. So hold it right at the tip in between these two middle fingers and then rest it on here. And then you take the second one and then you place it there and then rest it between the second and third finger and then put your thumb on there as well. So you've got three fingers supporting the second stick that you just put on and then it should look something like this. You move these three fingers and then you just move it to grab hold of whatever food you want to eat. Uh, so here I borrowed some uh, buttons from my uh, grandmother's sewing kit. Uh, I, I wanted beads but I couldn't find beads uh, now. I'm going to show off my amazing chopstick skills. So, you should basically be able to get hold of anything uh, using chopsticks. Chopsticks are really useful for, you can cut with them, you can pick up things, you can stab. Don't ever stick chopsticks into a bowl of rice uh, because that's what you do at a funeral. So it will be disrespectful to do it in wherever you are as long as you're not in a funeral uh, and don't eat basmati rice with chopsticks use chopsticks to eat sticky rice um, basmati rice basmati rice you eat with your hands like, you know Pakistanis Indians they, they eat with their hands but Japanese and Chinese we use chopsticks and sticky rice from the oriental side, not the Pakistani Indian side. So yeah, you can literally pick up these, literally anything, uh, and then maybe you, sh you guys should start with picking up something like paper like, and just practice holding it because most people, I think, they'll do something like that. They don't have like the precision to put the two ends together like that. Uh, so you just picking them up, and you just—it's just basically practice. There's no real secret behind it. Uh, just literally picking it up like this. I've seen people using it like that. That just disgusts me. Okay, so if you've truly mastered using the chopsticks, then you should be able to catch uh, flies. But here in this room, I obviously don't have flies kept here, so. Uh, my sister will be throwing a few objects at me and I'll watch, just, just watch. Meant to be fails, not successes. Ah, <laughs> they were both fails. 